Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Dobbs here. Bring you guys a playoff simulation video. That is right guys. So I don't really do these random videos kind of out of place that often. And I feel the need to to just do one, you know? Um, playoffs are starting tomorrow. It's going to be unreal. Just watch the draft lottery. Florida Panthers, they're going to be drafting first overall. So and the hype, the tension, everything. Oh, it's just going to be unreal. I can't wait. So what better to start it off? Or I shouldn't say start it off, but uh, what better to do a little simulation just to see uh, who um, who comes out on top. I mean, obviously it's a simulation. It's not going to be accurate, but uh, just for shits and giggles, why not, right? So let's get started here. All right, so Division A, we're going to be starting with the Colorado Avalanche. Uh, we got the St. Louis Blues, Chicago Blackhawks, and Minnesota Wilds. So the first and fourth seed are going to be playing each other, and then obviously the, two, the second and third seed uh, are going to be playing each other as well. So Colorado versus Minnesota. Uh, four stars across the board for Colorado. Uh, four and a half for St. Louis. I imagine, yeah, so the same thing for the Chicago Blackhawks. Minnesota, four and a half star offense, four star defense, and four star goaltending. So that is it for Division A. Now, Division B, all right, so we've got the Anaheim Ducks, four and a half star offense, four star defense, four and a half star goaltending, uh, San Jose Sharks, four and a half star offense, defense, four star goaltending, Los Angeles Kings, four and a half stars across the board, and the Dallas Stars with four and a half star goaltending and four star offense and defense. So, uh, Division B looks pretty strong, and I'm really going to be looking forward to games, uh, from this division, so it's gonna be a lot of a uh, lot of fun. Uh, especially, I'm really looking forward to the Anaheim and Dallas series. I, I really don't know what to make of it, but it'll be very interesting. So that is that for Division B. Division C, we got the Boston Bruins, four and a half star offense, four star defense, and four and a half star goaltending. Uh, the Tampa Bay Lightning, four and a half star offense and defense, four star goaltending. Montreal, four and a half stars across the board, and Montreal, we got four and a half star defense, goaltending, and three and a half star offense. So that is Division C. And last but not least, Division D, we got the Pittsburgh Penguins, New York, or I should uh, go through the ratings, uh, four and a half star for both offense and defense, four star goaltending, uh, we got the New York Rangers with four and a half stars across the board, Philadelphia, four and a half star offense and defense, four star goaltending, and Columbus, four and a half star goaltending and four star offense and defense, so making for a really, really um, good uh, playoff, so looking forward to it but let's get to it boys uh you must select one team all right so we're gonna uh, just gonna select the detroit red wings uh that's who i want to win the stanley cup so let's get going here are you sure you want to advance hell yeah so lowering the playoffs probably gonna be like a 10 minute video i'm guessing probably even a bit longer so sit back relax and let's get going here boys all right so playoffs number one here we go all right, so how it's gonna work? I just want to make sure everything turned out all right. Um, let's just take a look really quick here. So Colorado, Minnesota, uh, that good, 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 good. All right, beautiful. So we got the bracket set up. Uh, we're gonna be controlling Detroit. Uh, if they get knocked out, I'm not quite sure how it works. This is my first time doing this, uh, but nonetheless, it's gonna be a lot of fun. So. Um, I'm just gonna do just the normal simulation. I'm not gonna go in depth or whatever. I'm not gonna do the uh, uh, the in-game simulation. That just takes way too long, and so we're already three and a half minutes in the video. So uh, let's get going here. All right. So Boston, Detroit. Let's take a look. Who will win? All right. So let's get going here. Uh, also, I forgot to mention that injuries are on, so there will be automated uh, rotation, goalie rotations, edit lines, all of that. Uh, the computer takes care of that, so I'm not going to be uh, controlling that. So this is all by the computer, all right? So let's see who wins. And it looks like the Detroit Red Wings won that one in pretty easy fashion. Uh, I think I, I'm pretty sure I guessed, was it five or six? I'm not quite sure. Uh, but they won in uh, one, two, three, four, so five games of the Detroit Red Wings. Uh, kind of surprising not gonna lie uh, looks like we, uh, Danny Cleary's uh, injured there uh, so that sucks three weeks he's probably not gonna be back for quite a while uh, but we'll take a look at the playoffs now uh, so Chicago Blackhawks beat, beat out the uh, St. Louis Blues Minnesota Wild they beat out the Colorado Avalanche Anaheim beat out Dallas San Jose beat out LA uh, I'm kind of surprised there. I thought LA would win. Uh, Tampa Bay beats out the uh, Montreal Canadiens. Pittsburgh beats out Columbus. And the New York Rangers beat out Philadelphia. So, uh, you know, that, those are pretty good picks, honestly. Um, I kind of went uh, with my own personal picks against um, what other people are uh, hyping it up to be. So, like, everyone's like, oh, Chicago final, Boston final, all this stuff. So, um, it'll be interesting. It looks like it's pretty accurate so far uh, based on... Uh, 
people's predictions, but mine often uh, tend to be different because I like to be different when come this time. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, we have the Detroit and Tampa Bay series. We'll also look at stats and all that after. Uh, I guess we could do that after every round, but why not, right? So, uh, injuries. Uh, Ryan Murray... Uh, Mark Stahl, Alexander Steele, I'm just going to scroll through, I'm not going to go through each one, you guys can see that, um, play off advancement, we went through that, uh, message center, uh, save percentage, god damn, Henry Lundquist is tearing it up, so holy shit, man, that's insane, <laughs> 972, my god, Ben Bishop, you guys can just take a look at the stats, I'm not going to run through it, uh, Matt Molson leading in points, I'll just go by the league leaders, um, Howard before wins, uh, goals, we got Matt Molson with five, uh, and uh, assist with Johan Franz and lean with five, all right? So let's get going here, all right? Let's see uh, how the Tampa Bay series will match up. So um, let's see. Oh, and Detroit wins. Jeez, I think that was one, two, three, four. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. So they win in six games. Wow, that's insane, man. I'm really not expecting this from Detroit. I hope this would be the outcome, but uh, really interesting. Cool. So loss right there, three nothing win. Shout out for Howard. Uh, shout out for, uh, I think it's Bishop, right? Yeah, so it would be Bishop. 2-1 uh, win, 4-1 win, and 4-2 win to seal the deal. Off against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Holy. So um, that's pretty interesting. Uh, we'll go through the save percentage and all that. Uh, now it's bro oh, so yeah, Lundqvist came down a little bit. Still an amazing save percentage. Uh, Bobrovsky, 9.61. He's doing really well. Uh, uh, also leading goals uh, against. So and uh, yeah, so we'll go on to points. Uh, Zetterberg with 13, uh, Flurry with eight wins, uh, five goals for Zetterberg, and nine assists for Pavelski. And uh, the playoffs are as follows. So we'll go take a look at uh, the whoa, where'd it go? Um, playoffs. Uh, doo -doo. Okay, here we go. So we got San Jose in Chicago and Pittsburgh in Detroit. Man, holy! So this is pretty intense. So um, up against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Wow, man. Oh, excuse me, I really wasn't expecting that, but uh, we'll see what happens. Let's simulate. Let's go here. Let's see what happens. Wow. Holy shit. Was that a sweep? Was Oh, my God. Detroit sweeps Pittsburgh. Holy shit, man. That's insane. So, Detroit and Chicago uh, final series. We'll do normal simulation for this. We'll simulate up to here. Uh, we'll do the normal simulation because we have uh, quite a bit of time. 7 minutes and 30 seconds. So, um... Well, that's how far we are into the video, but uh, wow, I really wasn't expecting Detroit going that far. That's insane. So, um, but yeah, they're coming clutch. So let's uh, take a look at the stats again. Bobrovsky's still leading, so he, um, he's out now, obviously. Uh, but yeah, wow, man. And Crawford's up there, uh, being out Howard by just a bit. Uh, goals against Bobrovsky still leading. Uh, Hosa leads the league with 16. Howard with 12 wins. Uh, Host has seven goals, uh, twelve assists for Pavelski, and it's a Detroit Chicago final. So this could be insane, guys. All right, so we'll do normal simulation, and we'll see what goes on. All right, so first period. Uh, oh wow, four nothing for um, Chicago. God damn. All right, second period. Four nothing still. All right, it doesn't look good for Detroit. So uh, looks like Chicago has won game one more than likely, and yeah, that's probably the case. So we got five nothing right there. Chris Versteeg. And it looks like that's going to seal the deal. We'll just do eight times. Six nothing. Goddamn, Howard. You're turning to Swiss cheese now. But uh, shout out for uh, Corey Crawford. And that even raises save percentage even more. So, um, wow, man. The Chicago just manhandled Detroit in that game. So, game two. Let's see if that changes. Uh, see if it doesn't. All right. So, let's go here. First period. See. Oh, another four goal. Oh, my God, Howard. What are you doing? Jesus, boys. You're just blowing it. Second period. Uh, one goal there. That is from uh, Stephen Weiss. Finally, this guy's back. Um, but yeah, we'll just do six uh, times speed. Uh, looks like Detroit's not going to win this one. Uh, hopefully, they can uh, pull it around. But uh, looks like the Chicago uh, Blackhawks are the clear winner here. And there we go. So, 4 1 win there for Chicago. 31 shots, 33 shots for Detroit. And these are the uh, stats that's followed so that you guys can take a look at that. And uh, all right, so third game uh, looks like Chicago is absolutely manhandling the Red Wings. So 
Um, I don't know if that would be the case in the, the real NHL, but uh, it'd definitely be an amazing series nonetheless. So let's go here. First period and one nothing Chicago. All right, so Johnny Taze coming back for injury. He scores a big goal there. Second period. Okay, two uh, for Detroit. So we got Erickson and Tatar on the board, and we'll just do the six times speed. So it's been pretty close shots-wise, uh, but yeah, Howard's just been shitting the bed. So obviously the Blackhawks have been getting better goaltending. And let's see if Howard can shut the door, and he does. So 2-1 win, uh, the Detroit Red Wings are back in the series, uh, making for a really interesting series. So uh, Taze from Hossa, uh, Tatar from Leg 1, Erickson from Leg 1, and Kendall. So Leg 1's having a pretty good playoffs too. Um, he's probably, yeah, he has a lot of points. Last time I checked, with the, he was leading the, the team in goals, so he probably has a lot of assists. Uh, but anyways... Let's go here, game four. Let's see if Detroit can bounce back, or let's see if Chicago can uh, manhandle them once again and take that stranglehold. All right, so let's see here. First period, and that uh, was zero zero. All right, shots are uh, eleven to seven. Uh, let's go here. Second period. Okay, so two one for uh, Chicago. Oh, excuse me. Uh, goals from Tatar, Seabrook, and Regan. And uh, we'll do the six times speed. All right. So, yeah, it just looks like Howard's not having good playoffs. And another one from Regan there. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, and another one from Vestique. So, uh, did Vestique. Oh, no, he didn't. Uh, that's, that's a lie. So, um, Vestique scores a good goal there in the third period. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, Regan gets a hat trick. So, um, I don't know what happened there. All right. So. Uh, yeah, he gets a hat trick there with the empty netter, and we'll send the period. All right, so looks like the Chicago Blackhawks, man, they're uh, did they win? Oh, okay, I was gonna say I was like, what? No, that can't be possible. So uh, they have a three-one series lead, and uh, they can win it right here. So let's have a look here. We'll go normal sim. And uh, we'll see what happens, all right? So first period, 0-0, zero, zero, uh, 17 shots for Chicago, 5 for Detroit. Second period, 1-1, one, one, so it uh, looks like um, uh, Crawford isn't having his best game. Uh, one from Keith and one from Ablocator, and now we'll do the 6 times speed. Uh, your playoff hopes are on the line, Detroit. So uh, one from Patrick Sharp. Oh, one from Pavel Datsuk. He's finally scoring oh, and right after Versteeg, man. A lot of third period goals from Versteeg. And it looks like the Blackhawks could win. Let's see. And the Blackhawks win the Stanley Cup. So um, EA Sports, man, they they think, uh, I shouldn't say that, um, the simulation <laughs> um, thinks they can repeat. So, wow, man, the Chicago Blackhawks winning the Stanley Cup. Jesus, man. So your Stanley Cup champions, two years in a row, your Chicago Blackhawks playoff mode is now complete. So uh, we'll take a look at the stats, a little wrap up. Uh, I think we're 12 minutes in. I would like it to be like a 15 minute video. So we're, we're pretty much on time. Uh, so we'll take a look at the team uh, stats of the playoffs. Uh, let's go with uh, point percentage. So uh, Chicago obviously goals for Chicago goals for per game uh, Chicago goals against we have the Blue Jackets. So yeah, they had they were a really good defensive team uh, Goals against per game. We have uh, Columbus there as well power play goals from Chicago um, So yeah, the power plays for Detroit and Chicago are really good total power plays Chicago with 89 uh, Power play percentage Chicago with 20.2 percent shorthand goals against we got the stars with two power play goals 13 Time short-handed. We got the Blackhawks at 75. PK. Uh, the Rangers 95.7. A really good penalty kill. Uh, sh I think it's uh, shorthand goals for you. So there we go. Two uh, home record. Six. Uh, well, can you sort that? I don't think you can. But you guys can take a look. So uh, I'll just gonna scroll down there. Uh, you guys can pause it at any moment. And then we'll look at the player stats for the points and all that. And uh, we'll take a look at the playoff tree and wrap it up. So... Uh, where do you, can you look at stats here, or, uh, let's, what's good, player stats, play, there we go, oh, I was gonna say, what the hell happened, but, uh, yeah, we'll go through each team, uh, so Zyberg leading Detroit with, uh, 15, we got, see, the LA Kings leading, uh, Gabrick, so, uh, three points there for Gabrick, um, Matt Molson with eight, so, yeah, he had a pretty good run, uh, Montreal Canadiens, let's see here, oh, two points, jeez, for Patriotti, that's all, Wow, I was expecting a little bit more there. Uh, Broussard with six. Uh, we got Matt Reed with three in five games. Uh, 11 points for Malkin. And uh, 15 points for Jumbo Joe. So he had a pretty damn good playoff. Uh, we got Tarasenko with three. Tampa Bay, we got Stamkos point a game. 
uh, we got Hosa with 20 points. Wow, he had a good uh, playoff run too. And uh, I think we're in the West. Okay, so yeah. We'll just take a look at the division leaders. Uh, division A was led by Hosa. We got Division B led by Thornton, Zetterberg for C, and Malkin for D. So that is it, guys. Uh, we'll take a look at the playoff tree. You guys can, uh, can we go back? Yeah, so there we go. That's the playoff tree. Uh, you guys can take a look at how many games and all that good stuff. So um, I'm not going to go through it. We're almost at 15 minutes right now. So you guys can take a look at the playoff tree. And obviously the finals were Chicago and Detroit and the Chicago Blackhawks are your Stanley Cup champions. So, wow, man. I really wasn't expecting that, but they repeated, so that was crazy. Uh, but anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And let me know in the comments who you guys think are going to are gonna win the uh, Stanley Cup. Uh, not no simulation or anything like that. Not who you want to win. But realistically, who do you think will win the Stanley Cup this year? Anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And be sure to like, comment, subscribe, guys, for more NHL 14 videos. That is right, guys. Peace. All this attention got me hyped, cut the lights Baby, this ain't only for the night Baby, this is life, uh This is where I'm taking flight and never touching down Said it, now they know I meant it when I say we run the town